I do relax some. It's more fun. Roof work. cool I got two of these and the harness but I've got to spray the roof and I'm going to show you guys what I'm doing to make it so I don't have to pressure wash like I did because that was really dirty um, so the spray I'm going to use I've got to figure out how to do this. Um, oh there it is okay I was going the wrong way. But the spray I'm going to use, I'm going to tell you all about. Hopefully it works. But it works with the weather and keeping the roof clean. But we'll discuss that later. <laughs> I'm a little nervous being up here again. These are perfect to have where I didn't have a rope completely helping me. Not sure if you can see me, but I'm yammering. So I gotta go around to the other side. So I gotta move the I gotta move the ladder again. Okay, so just more fun roof work. Just kidding. Oh, I threw the rope over here. The gutters are already full, but the good news is. I can use my blower because they're all dry. I better do that today. How fun. So at least, look at that. So at least I have this to hang on to, but attaching to the harness that I need to put on. I can do a couple of bee holes. That sounds so bad. I'm gonna do a bee hole. Oh, okay, yeah, I see. Whatever, childish. Don't ever quit being childish. Well, I mean, you know, childlike. Childlike. That's the philosophical statement of the day. <laughs> God.
know. There's always so much to do. I mean, I enjoy it, but some days it's hard. I do relax some, <laughs> but thank you for hanging out with me while I'm doing this. It actually makes me feel like I have company. When I show you this, I feel like you were here, <laughs> and I'm not kidding. And it really helps motivate me. And Dawn, I thank you so much for the harness and the ro ropes because they're gonna come in so handy. In fact, when I spray the roof, and I'm not doing it today, I'm gonna tell you what product I'm using and what's in it and how it works because I actually need to remember. I bought it months ago, but I researched it because I don't wanna be pressure washing like I had been that you've seen in the past videos. I don't wanna be doing that unless I'm paying someone to because it's really just a lot of time and it's scary and it's just a lot of work. Anyway, thank you. <laughs> I need to go in my window and it's open because I've got Willa's leash holding the ladder securely. Woohoo! But I have all my supplies in the window. Willa's inside. I open the window and she's moving around. I think she hid under the dining room table. She doesn't know what's going on. But of course now she can hear me. Hello! <laughs> so WD-40 is good to spray inside the hole first but honestly i may not even do that just because and this i put a lot of thought into i'm going to use the spray foam and i actually have a can that was already opened and it hasn't hardened up so i'm going to try it Ooh, i don't have scissors to cut the straw i have a new straw though anyhow i'm just going to gently spray this into each hole and then I'll let it dry and like I won't do this in the same day. I'll dig out just a little bit into the hole once it's dry and then I'm going to putty it and then I can stain it, well sand it, stain it and then seal everything again and the patches hopefully will you know blend in. So that's all I'm going to do. The foam is going to go all the way hopefully back into all the tunnels and hopefully they won't patch in the logs because they can. They can actually, even if you wood putty the front of the hole, they'll eat right out of it. I've done that before too, and I've read people experience that, but that's why the foam may work because it will go all the way. Unfortunately, it will, you know, close up the whole tunnel. So we'll see. So this is an adventure job. It's gonna take months to really know if it's working. So here I go. A woodpecker's been really getting snacks. The wood is all chewed up. So whatever ends up on the outside, I'll, you know, clean up, scrape away. I'm so scared. It'd be so cool to see it coming out all the holes. That would be like, oh my gosh, all my work is done. It's still going. That must be a really long one. It's the tunnel. Look at this, there's grass coming out of this hole. I probably should bring the camera up here so you can see what I'm doing. Because, you know, I'll count how many holes there are. I'm just guessing maybe 20 that I've got to do. But... <laughs> Okay, you guys, I need a new battery. So, I'm not gonna fool with going down the ladder, going through the house, climbing in. Here I come, Willa. They're coming in. It's a little, it's a little challenging. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's a good little yoga move there. Okay, I'm in. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I have no idea if the camera died. Oh. Oh 
Maya, move. Okay, here we go. Yes. I'm weird. But we know this. We know this. We already know this. Okay. Hey, you guys. So the full effect. Let's see. <laughs> I can't do it. Full effect. Okay. Here's what I have to climb. And there's all the fun stuff. Okay. So here we go. I'm so happy about this last eye bolt I put inside. And then, hi! <laughs> That's my little mirror in my bedroom. And look, there's the, out the pasture where the horses I just saw them when I went. Where are they? Well, Willa, where are you? Hang on. I'm so happy it gets me when I do this. Okay, so this is what we just found. You and me. <laughs> okay, so I wanted to show you this because look at that. A bee went in there. Bringing grass. Isn't that funny? Oh my goodness. Little bee. Well. So here's where the woodpeckers snacked. <laughs> Look at that. And then the foam obviously is nasty and I'll clean that up. But there's probably 20 holes. Look at them all. You know, the tunnels go really far back. And then up here, I've had wasps. There's still some around. There's one flying around me right now. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, he just went in front of the camera. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna put the camera away and be safe and finish just a little. And I will talk to you in a little bit. I need to be out romping around. I think we're gonna do that in a little bit. And of course we'll bring you along. <laughs> She's not doing well. Last week was definitely a special walk. And we're just gonna get some branches and dress up our doors at the cabin. And I hope you enjoy helping us. <laughs> it's a beautiful day with the sun in and out of the clouds. 
much more lush this year. So we're definitely going to take from it just a little bit. <laughs> Beautiful tree. Dexter, don't. Don't. No. Come on. I'm going to take over the camera. Come here, buddy. Get some from over here, sweetie. blackberries were last year. So this is definitely a little pasture we like to harvest things from. Hi Fifi! Oh, it's just such a neat thing to come out and do this with all the animals and just enjoy the beautiful weather. Willa's under the tree. She smells something. We'll have to go see. Look at these beautiful berries on the cedar tree. Cedar branches. Oh my goodness. And there's many of them. Oh, I just can't get over it. They're beautiful. Mm. You wanted to run the camera a little while, didn't you? I don't know if I can trust a cat to run the camera. Look <laughs> a bit there. <laughs> I gotta put these branches there. Watch out, Dexter. Here he comes. <laughs> We're getting a lot. Well, she's dragging. Oh. <laughs> little girl. Oh, she's gonna drink my coffee. Me first. Okay. <gasps> okay. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 Dad. Oh my goodness, me girl. <laughs> no. Who <laughs> <laughs> taught you how to do that? How did you get so good at that? Lights. 
so pretty. So pretty. I think someone likes that bone. Wow, we did good. We got a lot. And they're pretty. Really full. There. We did it. I think that's it. If we need more, we know where to go. 